How's it going everyone? Steve here with the GR Auto Gallery and today I have the pleasure of showing you around this 1979 Ford Bronco. First off, we're going to give you guys a nice walk around video that way you get a good idea of what the truck looks like. Then I'm going to pull it up on the lift so you can see the underside like the frame, exhaust, suspension, stuff like that. Then we're going to walk around the truck together, kind of go over the overall condition and then show you some cool features and mods. And last but not least, we're going to give you guys a running video so stay tuned and I hope you enjoy. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed the walk around as well as the underside video. Now, like I said, we're gonna go around the truck together, kind of go over the overall condition and then show you some cool features. So overall, the Bronco's in really nice condition. Uh, the white paint shows very, very well. It's kind of like an off-white. Uh, I'm not sure if this is called Oxford white, um, but it shows very, very well. You do have these nice, uh, this nice blue vinyl um, across the whole truck that shows very well. Um, whoever installed it did a good job. There's not really any air bubbles or anything I could find like that. Uh, the rear glass does go up and down with the key the switch up front i could not get to work uh, but yeah it is sitting on some aftermarket wheels with some massive bf goodrich uh, all terrains pretty much brand new a lot of life left on those um, you do have these nice side steps right there uh, i prefer those actually i don't like the ones that go along the whole side of the truck uh, just nice and simple uh, the truck is lifted not exactly sure what lift is on it uh, maybe i'll be able to find that out once i get it up on the lift uh, but overall really good exterior very nice interior as well looks like we have some nice uh, vinyl seats with some diamond stitching in the center no rips or anything in there uh, and then some more diamond stitching on the side panels in the rear um, and then the rear bench seat to match the front door cards are in very nice condition as well um, no rips or anything like that looks like this is coming off a little bit uh, but not a huge issue at all just have to re-glue that automatic transmission four-wheel drive Shows 55,000 miles on the odometer. Um, I could not get the regular headlights to work, but the brights do work. Um, and then the brake lights and taillights as well. No turn signals. Uh, you do have Holly Sniper EFI. Vintage Air that does work well, as well as Retro Sound. Uh, both of those work as they should. A good size center console with four cup holders. 79 Bronco owner's manual. If I can get this to open, there we go. Um, so this isn't really usable, uh, but you do have that there. Headliner up front is in nice condition as well. And then the visors come down and stay in place. Overall, just a really solid Bronco. You're definitely gonna turn some heads in this thing. Uh, definitely gonna have a blast doing it. So if you'd like to see pictures of the Bronco, feel free to go to our website. We have over a hundred pictures on there. Link is gonna be down in the description. If you have any questions whatsoever, please feel free to give us a call. We would love to help you out however we can. And also make sure you read the description under those photos on our website. It's going to give you a lot more information on the truck and hopefully answer some of your questions. Keep in mind, if you don't see the link in the description just yet, uh, we're waiting on a few things before we can list the truck for sale. So just be patient with us and it will be there soon. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, enjoy the rest of the video.